It's the era of astronomy. With light speed discoveries happening on a daily basis, we are able to get the most accurate analysis of planets, their stars, moons, and even distant exoplanets due to new marvels and technology. And using such technology over a decade, we have managed to take the closest images of the blinding bright ball nearest to us. Yes, the sun, the burning ball of nuclear fusion. Researchers have managed to capture the most granular images of the solar surface. With addition to satellites, there are ground-based observatories that solely focus on keeping a check on the sun. And when something is inspected with such vigilance, it will be impossible to miss if anything unusual occurs. But what if the news of this unusual event spreads and causes hysteria among the masses? Then, what happens? While this might sound like science fiction, but this event caused NASA to halt its live stream and the abrupt closure of a solar observatory by the FBI. So what was this event? That's what we shall be covering in this video. Welcome to Star Extreme. There is little space for everyone here. The story goes something like this. NASA's live sun cam allegedly crashed after a mysterious black cube appeared on the screen. The ominous black object was spotted in the bottom right corner of the sun for approximately two seconds before the live stream abruptly ended. In the footage, which is available for all to see on SOHO's official website, one can see a mysterious looking black cube coming out of the sun, and then immediately after that, a big glitch that covers 25% of that. Then it is gone, poof. So we've got two frames of the cube coming out of the sun, and then a huge glitch. Many have insinuated, and many more are absolutely convinced, that the space agency tried to cover up something strange that was seen during the incident using the front of experiencing glitches. Now, conspiracy theorists are saying that this is a cube, but to anyone familiar, this looks like a solar flare, and one so huge that it could gobble up Earth whole. But what is striking here, is the rectangle shape that appears just before the solar flare is spotted and then the live stream ends. Was that a glitch? Or was that something we weren't supposed to see? This is not the first time that live feed has got cut off when something strange appears or happens. The International Space Station also has a live streaming video feed, which allows space enthusiasts to view the Earth and outer space via cameras that are fitted underneath the orbiting structure. On multiple occasions, there have been sightings of unidentified objects with UFO enthusiasts claiming them to be alien visitors. These visitors are almost always proven to be something much more mundane, such as space debris. A number of times, NASA has appeared to have severed the live video feed. That is not suspicious, since that could be credited to a number of technical reasons. But some incidents have been a little odd. Like the time when the feed was cut just seconds after the strange object came into the camera's view. This not only created suspicion among already suspicious UFO hunters and enthusiasts, but also made many wonder if there have been cover-ups. Then there's this incident. 85 miles southwest of Roswell, New Mexico, where flying objects were spotted in 1947, sparking theories they could have been aliens or UFOs. A tiny white object can be seen above the trees, at the crest of the Sacramento Mountains. This is the Dunn Solar Telescope of the Sunspot Solar Observatory, a facility dedicated to studying the sun. Now let's go back in time. September 6, 2018. FBI agents on board Black Hawk helicopters are on a secret mission as they swoop over the Lincoln Forest Mountains in New Mexico. Their target, the Sunspot Solar Observatory, which is used by NASA to keep an eye on the sun. As soon as they reach the place, they swarm in and shut down the observatory. No information was given to those being evacuated about what was going on. They were simply asked to leave. Even the sheriff and the local police were left in the dark. The employees were silenced 
and made to sign secrecy agreements. And only after 11 days was the lockdown lifted. The FBI issued a statement saying that they were investigating one of the facility's janitors for possession and distribution of pornography. The person was said to have been fired, however, was not arrested or charged with any crime. But many, even till this day, find the janitor story a cover-up. So that makes you wonder, did they see something through that observatory that they shouldn't have? Or, did they do it to stop the observatory from seeing something during the time it was shut down? Some feared that NASA may have observed the sun shrinking in size, which is the beginning of its scent before it turns into a red giant, swallows Earth, and goes supernova. But follow-up observations over the years from other observatories show that our sun is absolutely fine. Then what could possibly be the reason? It is strange that the FBI had enough information to go to the location and shut it down for 11 days while they investigated and yet didn't make an arrest. Majority of the people believe this was a massive cover-up for something much bigger. Moving on. Are aliens harvesting energy from the sun? UFO hunters will say yes, claiming to have found evidence for star lifting and NASA images. Star lifting, a name to describe any process by which civilizations could remove material from a star and use it for themselves. In 1960, an American mathematical physicist, Freeman Dyson, first proposed that there could be a possible structure developed by an advanced alien civilization that completely encompasses a star and captures a large percentage of its solar power output. While humanity is far too low on the Kardashev scale to build such an object, perhaps there are other species who have mastered this type of advanced technology. Alien spacecraft could be surrounding the sun in order to harvest solar energy. At least, that is the latest claim made by UFO hunters, who believe that they have spotted evidence of star lifting in images taken by NASA. The image appears to show an unidentified white dot joined to the sun by a connected line. Is this a massive UFO feeding off sun energy? While the uploader admits to being initially skeptical, they appear to have been convinced the image may well show some sort of alien activity. The fact that the UFO is a different color and shape to the rest of the connected line is what doesn't sit right with the people. And this isn't the first time we have had odd sightings around the sun. NASA has observed events like solar flares, plasma discharges and comets. But there are numerous aspects about the sun we still don't understand. And considering that our race hasn't fully figured out its star, or reap tall of its energy. I recommend we keep looking and pondering the question, are we alone? Tell us what you think in the comments below. And if you still have not subscribed to the channel, make sure you do subscribe to Star Extreme. There is a little space for everyone here.